What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have the new Mosaic Basketball, finally. I feel like every time this set releases, it's uh, finally. But very happy to have this one. Love First Off Line Mosaic a lot. If you guys like these early reviews and product reviews, you want to see more, drop a like, subscribe. It helps us do a lot more. And uh, yeah, let's get into the information for this set. So I'll get to the size and the back real quick. But SRP for this is $250. Resale for Hobby is like low $300 range. And then First Off the Line, this one's a little interesting. It's like I say mid $600 range, which is way more than last year's. Not too sure why, but you get 15 cards in every single pack, 10 packs per box, 12 box cases. Every box has one autograph, 20 parallels, and then 20 inserts. Those are not the most exciting, but I'll get more into that during the review. So here's the back. Book four. First off the line has uh, two swirls, which I consider to be a very strong first off the line bonus. They changed the way these work. There's pink to 20 and green to five. Used to be to 10 and 11. Now it's 20 and 5. Parallels include black 1 of 1s, gold to 10, white to 25, and then new is pink to 149, and blue is now to 199, and then the mosaic glitter. So inserts, there's rare, or rarer, I should say. There's straight fire, there's storm chasers, there's swagger, overdrive, stained glass, and razzle dazzle. Then autographs are new collage and pictograph autos. Not that exciting, honestly. I've seen what they look like. They're pretty regular. And then base autos, and uh, that's pretty much it with parallels. So the... Exciting news actually is the uh, this here, the checklist. There's no more of the debut and the Hall of Fame stuff and All-Stars. It's just 250 cards, base, and rookies. That's a plus. Obviously, some of those are rookies, more odds for rookies, but those weren't too popular, so I personally don't mind those going bye-bye. But here we go. Let's get into our review. And um, yeah, I'm excited because last year was definitely a juicy product. First off, the line that is. So Hobby is usually much more watered down. Not a huge fan of the Hobby version of this product, but first off, the line has been excellent. So here we go. And there are the packs. Let's get into our review. In the background, we have Lamello, Envelope, and Wade Winningham. The final video from the Kate event coming soon. Has some delays, but it is coming soon. So stay tuned. The biggest of them all. So... There we go, and that's a little sneak peek, that card in the back. A little mosaic action. Love that one for the PC. And here we go. So if you guys like these uh, reviews, I try to do early as often as possible. Then like and subscribe, it's free and helps us do tons more content. And uh, yeah, you can do it down below. I see something here. Got to pony up a lot for these boxes. I actually completely missed out. I mentioned the price is higher. I thought it'd sell out much Less introductions during these look good I like that and I completely missed out on the drop um sold that way higher than I thought but big shout out to Rip Hamilton Rips my guy I'll link him down below he does breaks on whatnot as well and um he sold me a couple boxes so big thanks to him their straight fire looks much different this year this is um not fully full bleed fire like last time but that's a rarer one so yeah big thanks to him and because of him we have a review early review and Scotty Bar okay. Sometimes I'm still like, oh, rookie, but it's not a rookie. These years have been so thrown off. We got their rookies as recently as like a month ago. But to 99. What do you guys think about the design? I kind of like it. Not the best card to show for the design. This one is. I like background, got the little hexagon, honeycomb. Cool. Let's keep going. So with First off the line, I'm with Hobby. Hobby is like half the price, but I feel like where I mentioned there's 20 parallels, like 19 of those are like worthless. So yeah, don't be deceived. And with first off the line, you get two super short prints. There's Diabate, my guy, cha-ching, and then maybe one or two numbered cards with it because they condense the checklist. And now it's just 250. There's less, but they also increased the print run of parallels and added a new one. So lots more being made, of course. But they did get rid of the debuts and stuff like that. So there's Stairmasters. Okay. There's AJ Griffin introductions. And there we are. Cool. Finally, Bolt Sports. Ramping up. I'm excited. And excited for some Wemby stuff. And other new products. We have something here, I think. Marvin Bagley. 
Yes, sir. I have a lot of Marvin Bagley. I have a lot of DeAndre Ayton. I don't have a lot of Luka, funny enough. I opened a lot during 18-19, and I got Bagley. I got Landry Shamit, Zaire Smith, I think his name was, and more, but not Luka. All right, let's see. There's a blue. If I sound a little kind of off, I'm a little under the weather, so please do uh, forgive me. But wanted to get this review for you guys. Yeah. Oh. All right. Boat champ. There you go. Mr. Was it 82 or 92? A lot of points. And then J. Will. 199. All right. To start, blue rookie, I'll take. Three number cards already. Or two, I'll definitely take. Last year, like one number card per box. First off the line, the bonus is very strong. Two super short prints and a number card or more. So that's why I like it. And there's, that's the five. Here we go, fellas. Bones. Reed, this guy is the man of the summer. This guy is, every post on Twitter about basketball is Reeves. His shoe, him doing press tours, Team USA. This guy is on top of the world. So good for him. Got, this is new, Breakaway. Hallow Blanket. There we go. For those in our Discord, you understand that. We have a free Discord. Link's down below. And uh, have a nice community there. And IG's back there. Ooh. Okay. All right. These are nice. I'd love a parallel of this. Notoriety. Steph Curry. Dubs Draft Star Shooter. I can't read that bottom one. I don't think we're supposed to be able to. But this is nice. Hmm. All right, Mosaic. You know what? I might take back my initial statement. And here's a red. Maybe I don't take it back. The reds are the worst. Not numbered. Buddy healed. Oh, I take that back. That's a boom. Silver Mosaic. Boom. Spencer Irving. And here's the green. Moses Moody. And Tyrese Martin there. It is to five. It is to five. It is... Year two, Moses Moody. Trying to justify it. There we go. So nice. Super, super, super short print. The second rarest parallel you can get. So I'll take it. We'll see how they do. They, I mean, him and Kaminga. I always bunch them together for some reason. Let's keep going. Can we get two of those? That's the big question. So the first cards are always base. Base. Not always. Worthless, though. Bane. Bang. New Celtic. Chet. There we are. What do you guys think about Chet? Is he that guy? His stock has risen. Oh, Brogdon. Here we go. The big red. Ooh. Here you go. That's called profit right there. There's a montage. KD. That's pretty cool. I like that. Three pictures. And another Dern. We have half our packs. Let's keep going. All right, come on, Mr. Paolo. Paolo on the wrapping and in the packs. Hello? Interesting. Let's see. I think the numbered output has risen a lot. That'll happen when they increase the print on all of them. And Paolo, now you don't have to look here. In the past, it would say like debut, all NBA. Now it's all true. Got the little Disney logo. Apollo. Oh, here we go. Agbaji, that should be to 20. And it was to 11, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. Yeah. Green was to 10. Now these went from 11 to 20. So there we go. I pull them a lot. Hopefully it's good. Although because I pull them a lot, concerning. And there we are. All right. Next card up. Let's see. Yeah. So once again, a little under the weather, if you see a lot of cuts in videos sometimes, either allergies, I'm sick, or just mess up. So, that card is Breakaway Kyrie, and Razzle Dazzle Jaw. Nice, that was one of the preview cards. And there we go. Looks gold, it is not gold. The color itself is kind of goldish, but it's not a gold parallel, I wish. I'd be freaking out right now if it was. They're nice. New, they've jumped around in a lot of different sets, but 
This is a rarer insert, kind of like stained glass. They're not the rarest. You'll probably get at least a few per case, but there you go. All right, let's see what this is. And it is Herb Jones to 149. Yes, sorry. Cool. All right, put them here. Last uh, four packs. Let's see what we can do. Here we go. I see red. Once again, every pack, red. And here we go. Jake. Got a little Sohan and Booker. And that's it. A lot of breakaway. Last three packs. And it just dawned on me. We still need the autograph. Because the autographs usually miss in this product, maybe two good ones per case, I always forget about them. And I'm never looking for the autographs. We have... Okay. Purple? I think that's purple. We have Tari. We got Watson. Well, KJ. And from the back, Trey Montage. And Trey Montage. I noticed he got it twice from his pack. And D'Lo. Getting shots up. Respect to 99. There we go. Next pack up. With only two packs left, I feel like the autograph has to be that last pack. It always is the last pack. No matter which order we go in. Oh, no, it's this pack. Never mind. Yeah, here we go. All right, let's see. It's been solid. Not great. But let's see how this auto takes care of us. Or doesn't take care of us. All right, got a little Joker. And Clay. Rudy. Giannis. And I'm going to go like this. I was wrong. Elvin Hayes. Not bad. Little legend action. Nice autograph for sure. Got that ink work. A little off sticker, but cool. Elvin Hayes. I've seen a lot worse. I've seen better, but I've seen worse. So I'll take it. And the final pack of Mosaic. First off the line. So a hobby box would not have those two parallels. And with past releases, I feel like we didn't get as many numbered in hobby versus first off the line. So here we go. The end, there's Ivy and Mac McClung. I like that. Pretty cool. Avdia. You know what? We'll save the big red for last, obviously as a monster. And oh, J-Dub, notoriety. I like. And Giannis and bang, Bradley Beal, new son. There we go. What do you guys think? If you guys like these reviews, once again, drop a like, subscribe. Help us do some more content on this channel. And once again, it's free. Here's our final hand recap. Got some nice rooks. Elvin Hayes, solid. D'Lo. Got a good amount of numbered cards, I'd say. Razzle Dazzle, Ja, new one. And rarer. Got Baji, Chet to five. Curry. I like this new set. J. Will. And Scotty. And that's it. Solid. Nothing insane from this one, but fun rip. Better than Hobby, even two boxes versus one of these. I think I'd still take first off the line. So that being said, my rating for this one, I'll give it a seven. Last year, I think I gave it like a like a low six. And then we opened cases and I bumped that up a lot. So I'll say seven, reason being the price is higher. And then also there's some really good bonuses in general, which helps that rating. So a hobby being, you know, a format that does not have those, these two right here. I'd say like a four like point five. Four point five. Sorry, Hobby. I've never seen Hobby be like really, I don't know, overwhelming. It's kind of just be like, eh, all right. You get your case hits, but I'm usually disappointed. I feel like when I see Hobby boxes of this product open, a lot of reds, nothing too special. First off the line has these two. So that's why I like it more. And does it for this review. Does it for this one, guys. Got a lot of uh, fun stuff in these boxes. Hopefully, you can hit them. The Defives make a big chase, and the Razzle Dazzles are pretty nice. I like them. So yeah, could be better, could be worse. But overall, I'd say above average compared to other products. So those are the first one, guys. Thank you as always for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Till next time, I'll see you later.